Mario RPG is a really great game, and so many fans were happy when it got a remake. And I never played the old one, but I did get the new one a remake, and it's pretty darn good, I won't lie. And I think it means a lot for what's to come in the Mario RPG series for the Nintendo Switch, because there hasn't been many RPGs Mario RPGs on the Switch, mostly just the virtual consoles and Paper Mario Origami King, but this remake got so many people happy and excited that I really think Nintendo is going to try and make some more, and I think they've completely revived the Mario RPG series. I mean, they're already remaking the Thousand Year Door, so there's a pretty good chance. The last RPG, and the only other RPG on the Switch for Mario, is Paper Mario and the Origami King, which came out July 12th, 2020. Now, it's a pretty good game, but, eh, I mean, there's better Paper Marios, and uh, I'm glad I'm remaking Thousand Year Door for the Switch. But that's only gonna be three RPGs on the Switch for Mario, and... That's not much, compared to a lot of the other brands on the Switch. But, on the Nintendo 64 Switch Online app, I don't know what to call it, there is the original Paper Mario. And on the Game Boy Advance one, there's the Mario RPG Superstar Saga. So I really think that there is a pretty big chance that we're gonna get at least maybe some ports, or maybe even some more remakes. Because, I mean... People really like these series, and I think everyone would be happy if we got a couple more. You never know. Probably one of the best RPGs that should go on the Switch, in my opinion, is Bowser's Inside Story. Because it sold pretty well on the DS. J just, just a little well. And a remake that looks fully HD and like high graphics that would probably sell insanely well and we all know nintendo loves their money so they really should do that game that would probably be one of the best contenders now this might be an unpopular choice for another rpg for mario that i would love to see on the switch but paper mario color splash i really like the game it's probably one of my favorite wii u games of all time and i don't really know why it just feels so fun and like refreshing. I remember waking up every morning playing it. That was actually recently, like a couple months ago. But whatever, yeah, I still use a Wii U in 2023. I'm, I'm apps, I'm, I'm, I'm awesome, right? <sighs> I think the Wii U is pretty underrated. But anyways, Color Splash just feels like a Switch game. I mean, it would be perfect for the Switch. I mean, it has the touchscreen capabilities, and you can play the entire game on game uh, with the gamepad. You don't even need the TV. The whole game you can play on the gamepad. It would probably be perfect for the Switch, and I could actually really see it on there as a good idea. That's all for this video. It's more short, but I just kind of wanted to talk about this. And, um, yeah, that's really it. And uh, at 2K, I will be making all my old videos public again. So if you want to see my old videos, and you like the video, these videos, then maybe subscribe. Or don't. And, uh, it's up to you. Alright. See ya.